Good evening, Mr. Bond fans. Back with another look inside a genuine Fleming first edition. This time, the man with the golden gun from 1965. This is a bit of an interesting first edition for collectors, and I'll get into why in just a few seconds. But first of all, I want to talk about this quite unusual jacket that wraps around the whole book. It's a Richard Chopping design. It looks really awesome, and I absolutely love it when it's unfurled. But it slightly bothers me that it's kind of spread out over both sides of the book and the spine, so you can't really see it in all its full glory when it's on the shelf. And there's no title down the spine either. But then, who am I to quibble with greatness? Opening it up, the end papers have this kind of green and white marble effect, and her first edition is identifiable by having publisher Jonathan Cape on the title, page like this, and then overleaf it should say, first published 1965, with no other editions stated. So interestingly, there are two versions of the Man with the Golden Gun in first edition form, one incredibly rare version with an embossed golden gun on the front board, and one without, and that's the version that I have. Apparently the publisher held back on the feature for the whole run as the gold foil was too expensive, but versions without are still counted as first editions, they're just not as rare or sell for such eye-watering amounts. Still, at least they saved enough gold foil for the spine tech. 